I'm Winona. I work at Paul Dojak Youth Center. I am a facility youth worker. Paul Dojak Youth Center, for those who may not know, is a youth custody facility. It houses um, young offenders from age 12 to 18, um, sometimes up to 21, depending on a sentence. I'm a facility youth worker. I will work like one-on-one -on -one with those young offenders. Um, we do lots of programming um, with them. Anything related to like their admission and their discharge, if they're on my caseload, I will take role in that. Our programming focuses on like their high-risk areas, so we'll work on like the education, family, their social skill development, leisure and recreation, um, lots of things we'll just work on um, while they're with us, and we'll target those high-risk areas while in custody and as well as out of custody. There's quite literally no typical work day. I think that's kind of the fun of it, is everything is a little bit different. What led me to Dojak was nothing professional, actually, um, but it was my uh, police studies degree, and then I just kind of knew I wanted to do something within that field. It was a great stepping stone, and then clearly I've stayed since. I really like the job. Once you are hired, um, you do an 11-week training course called Induction Training Program. Within there, you learn all of like your core correctional practices to your restraint training so and everything in between so you learn how to like interact with the offenders um, as well as do like paperwork and case management de-escalation techniques you learn a lot within there and then once you're on the job you definitely learn a lot more i would say successful candidates in this um, going into this profession would need good communication de-escalation techniques um, awareness healthy coping mechanisms, be able to manage your stress, um, know how you respond in a very high stress situation so that you can accurately respond. I love interacting um, with the youth. Um, as much as you can teach them things about dealing with their own criminal history and responding to situations differently, they teach you so many things. So it's lots of fun interacting with them, learning more about like their lifestyle and just who they are as people because you really do get a lot of one-to-one -one interactions. It can be quite fun. So I think that's my favorite part of the job is just interacting. So for youth that would like to get involved with this um, career field, I would definitely say education is a good one, whether you're going into human justice, anything criminal related, um, as well as I took a police study, so that was a good option for me. Definitely work in the human service field, um, volunteer, try to work with youth. All of those things will get you quite a ways. Considering the incarceration for Indigenous people, I would definitely say learning about them and their culture. I think that a high school student should know that even though this job can be very intimidating, it can be very rewarding at the end of the day. You could definitely go home at the end of the day knowing that you might have made the slightest impact in someone's life and or just the community as a whole, right? So I think that is the best thing of the job.